Tonight, CBS 6 problem solver Shelby Brown has an update on a local nonprofit working to distribute funds from the state's rent and mortgage relief program. All Deja Shelton can think about is finding and keeping a more stable home for herself, her two-year-old daughter and baby that's on the way. Like so many Virginians out of work during the pandemic, Shelton is struggling to stay afloat. Searching for work and dodging the virus are always top of mind. Her biggest fear is being out on the streets. She knows what it's like to be hours away from that very fate. It's a horrible feeling waking up knowing that you have to leave where you lay your head or where you can't have somewhere to stay. And it's honestly, it's struggle, it's hard, it's tiring, it's draining, and it just makes a person feel like giving up on life. This bright smile is what keeps pushing her. Each day she tries to find rent relief that can tide her over until she begins her job at a fast food restaurant and can save enough money to move from a local motel to an apartment. She's reached out to Axe RVA to access funds through the Virginia Rent and Mortgage Relief Program. That's the $50 million initiative started by the governor in June. Shelton is waiting to hear back like so many others. Not being able to have income, not being able to have money or anything, it's just hard and it just, it makes, like I said before, it makes a person just want to break down. And but Shelton chooses to remain hopeful that help through the state program will come. In Central Virginia, Axe RVA, which is distributing the mortgage and rent relief funds, has been inundated. It would honestly be a tremendous big help. Problem solvers found out from June through September 23rd, the state has received or processed more than 6,900 applications for Virginia households, dispersing more than $10.4 million in rent and mortgage payments for 4,754 households in Virginia. Families can still apply for rent relief through Axe RVA by dialing 804-644-2401. Leave your name and contact information and a caseworker will call you back. There's generally an 8 to 14 day waiting period due to the high volume of calls. Landlords are also now able to apply for rent relief on behalf of their tenants. Working for you, I'm Shelby Brown, CBS 6 News.